on the fresh. And that is it. And they were going to get the defuse again. Look at that. Only one player just fresh dropping that round, uh, Sam. And everyone else still up. I'm not sure uh, whether this was the best idea from Elevate, to be honest, to, uh, to to jump into attack first. It's kind of a Defense. little bit arrogant, do you think? I no, don't know. Defense, I find very hard to defend. If, you, if you've... Uh, if you've set up your attack right and you get that smoke down, um, block it off. That way you can really set up your attack. So I think attack's probably more of an advantage than defense on this map, to be honest. I don't know. I'm, I, I might I might still disagree. Still disagree, but I guess it depends on... I know some teams really will struggle on defense, while others will find offense a little bit easier. But... Uh, Perhaps comes down to the quality of the team that you are playing against and how much you've played it. Rain going to take out Fresh this time for First Blood, so uh, not going to get tricked up. Someone climbing through the garden bed, that was uh, quite embarrassing for him last round. Having someone come around, just uh, prone around that corner and pick him up. Four into four, because they have also, did they drop someone as well? Must have come back, perhaps. Any case, uh, four and four, Trevs is down. And uh, Muni here, all these cars are still alive as well. They haven't blown up, so it's a little bit dangerous to hang around here at this B-bomb. He's out of smoke, he's out of nades, so someone's going to have to do something here if they want to get this bomb down. They're just uh, holding back, hopefully uh, trying not to get flanked this time, because that's always a little bit unfortunate. Mitch and Muni here, stacking on this uh, on the van at B-bomb, just waiting to get naded. Secure will... Uh, S-I-Q-L, sequel, sequel, I don't even know how I'm... Sequel, we'll take that Mitch with that headshot, uh, and he does know Muni is there oh. as well, he sees him jump around the corner, so, uh, should we have to get him, someone's in shop as well, so he's gonna need to be careful, Muni will retaliate and take him out, Raptor now has scope, and, uh, they're gonna have to do something here, but they're gonna get this bomb down, Ray will pick up, Ray and Exalt, gonna take out Raptor with the scope, so it's a... They're actually, it's interesting to see the boys, uh, well, the, the Elevate guys uh, lose those those uh, scope one-on-ones as they have been. I, I think Mitch had it before and he dropped scope. Muni going to take out Ray. He's got his Strax, oh. he's got to take him down. Nice work, 27 seconds on the clock. He only has uh, scope to beat, he just needs to not poke and Muni is... He's pretty clued up here. When you get the bomb defuse, it's not a fake. Oh, uh, he's going to get this. He's going to get it, Sam. Wow, 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 wow. Wow, 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 oh. wow, 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 wow. This is going to be embarrassing. Oh, what happened? Oh, oh, oh. They got it. Wow. They got it. Did he get the They defuse? get it. Two to three. I think he did. Looking at the score, they got wow. it. Wow. Wow. That, it, it does not. Sometimes it pays to not go in for that fake. Oh, I've lost connection Little again. What's the doing to, count to me? To eight. Or is it this Pop server which second, is having problems? One second sooner. Well, I'm still in the server I night, so... Unsure. Are you? If you're at the moment, I'll keep going then, because Fresh, uh, Fresh picks up Rain again in the middle, just with that flank. I don't understand why he keeps getting picked up there. It's, it's not ideal. Fresh going to try and pick up, I think, uh, perhaps Mitch up on that top of A-bomb. But uh, with that UMP, just a little bit... A little bit outranged. Raptor going to go down to Strax. Muni going to pick up Strax in return. Four and three with uh, with uh, Endless here with the advantage. Mitch is going to go down. Fresh is going huge. He, he is picking up all these Elevate players in really weird positions in, in things I would not expect them to see. Like, I would not expect these guys to get picked up so easily by someone just with a, a simple, simple flank through the middle or flank from the middle even. So only one player left, and that is Trebs, and he's in a little bit of trouble. We've got Ray here in uh, in the middle of the garden. We have Sickle having a look over B-Bomb and Exalt up with the scope. He's just holding onto that nade. I think he's actually waiting for the uh, the bomb plant to go down so that he can nade him and uh, pick him up with a bit of a laugh. So, And it looks like Trebs might actually come through here. He might be able to see uh, Exalt with, with, with that. Nade? No, maybe not. He's going to grab the bomb. He's going to go for the bomb plant. Exalt's going to throw the nade now, I would suspect. And he's going to pick him up. So uh, that was actually quite funny, just uh, hanging back. Rain's going to call dead round for the next round, I think. Cyanide, uh, you're on their team. Yeah, perhaps. no, I, I joined just so, just, so, um, just so I could see You can't him. grab spectator when you come in, can you? No, no I so can't, because I had a uh, Steam Connect fail, so scores are... 
Two to four here. Elevate going into damage control. Is this a dead round or not? It is, is a dead, dead round. round. So let me push my number three. For me, or something like that. I think that's how it sounds. It certainly is. Let me change that too. Is, you know, it's made up of three sounds. It's like electric car window, like a lion roaring, and some other motor. Seriously, when you when you when you make it, they're the sounds that, that come with it to get those three things. Well, it is Look pretty weird. awesome. No, so a few Steam Connect issues there. I don't know what Steam's doing to me. Raptor's left the game, so he, maybe he's... Uh, but the players were bitching a little bit, so not too sure what's going on. But let's have a look at this. I mean, for starters, Endless here. Um, and I still stand by the fact that attack is harder on this map, and that's probably why those scores uh reflect or oh, sorry defense harder or easier defense defense is harder Defen defense i don't, harder, I don't okay. remember my own bullshit anymore do i no nah, it's all good <laughs> i'll keep you straight but Sorry, let's no, have I'll a look at these straight. uh let's have a look at these scores quickly man if you want to run through those scores yeah sure we've got um mooney here carrying the um elevate boy he's gone seven to three there for his team not sure what mooney does i think it's the um Russia, I think he clears shop and then trucks his smoke down B, hopefully giving cover to a bomb planter, or maybe he does plant the bomb. I'm not quite sure. You've got Rang going 5-5. Five to five. He does watch the mid, um, getting taken out by Fresh quite a few times there. And Mitch, he's got ACR covering bomb planter as well as Trez. And you've got one more, Raptor's scope or Termi watching flank. And Elevator just... Struggling a tiny bit on attack here. But yeah, it's good to I see believe... Mitch. It's good to see Mitch with the scope again. I think. Um, who normally has it for these boys? Raptor, isn't it, Sam? Man. Raptor does. Raptor. Yeah, I so... thought Raptor was scope. Mitch had it before, and he swapped out to Raptor when he lost to Exalt, and then uh, Raptor lost to him as well. So, I think they're just mixing things up here, seeing who can who get the poke. But uh, certainly having a little bit of trouble on that B side from shop. Yeah, for taking sure. Taking out scope. And on defense, though, we got Sickle with 6 4, Fresh with 6 6, Exalt with 5 3, Ray just been a little bit quiet at the moment, 2 3, and Strax with 1 and 4. So probably Strax needs to lift, but what's. Uh, yeah, I mean, they're, they're, they're lucky to pick up those rounds. Oh, Mitch is saying we're playing 4v5. Mm, so Londis they've got another dead round. I would take the other uh, dead round there. So, dead round by the looks of it. That's what I get from that. And now I can do my dead Please. round properly. I had, the, I had the game over the dead round in me, so it didn't come up properly last time. I fixed that. So, so Ray's just saying that term. He's got some problems there with uh, UAC. It doesn't want to open. Sometimes that happens, especially if you uh, leave the game. It goes a bit uh, spastic. But interesting... Um, interesting is the score, really. So we're sitting on 2-4, even though in-game it says 3-4 because of that dead round, and defense will... Probably. So are they waiting another round, Cyanide? Yeah, is that it, it, is, it is another They found round. out they had one more? Well, we, we heard all sorts of stories. Uh, someone went for dinner, but then um, Termi was having problems getting into uh, UAC. UAC was giving him a bit of grief, which it can. It doesn't like to shut down and start and work very often. So, my prediction is still with Elevate. They're having some hiccups at the moment. A bit of bad luck with uh, players and just not pulling it together. So, my vote, though, is still with Elevate. What about you, Sam, man? Yeah, well, it's hard to go right past Elevate, to be honest. Though, the guys are playing well, but I f I'm finding that the ways that Endless are winning, I would hope that by the end of this 15-round attack, uh, Elevate's probably found a way not to die those stupid things and I think they would be thinking the same themselves at the moment not dying to fresh coming through mid not getting out scoped uh, over on B-bomb just they need to not get picked off 
and uh, not not throw away a couple of players. So I, I still think that defense is easier, and I think definitely think defense is going to be easier against Endless. To be perfectly honest, I I think they may struggle on attack, especially against Elevate, who who have proven again and again and again how good they are with those ACRs uh, when they're holding that B bomb. So we'll see what happens, but hopefully they can get another player in here because. No matter how good you are, it's always going to be difficult with four under five. Yeah, it is. And I think now the game has started. It's well and truly into the game where, what time is it? We're 40 minutes from the start of the game. There we go. There we go. Good old uh, Raptors back in. So I think even if, even if they drop one now, the game would still continue. Um, it wouldn't matter that they've got four because of... How far into the game we are, even though it's fresh as far as six rounds go. But here we go. We are live now, Sam. So hopefully my connection can remain stable. Mooney with the bomb once again, doing all the hard work. Trev's here. So they're sitting down. Is this another... I was getting confused then. They're all sitting back in that top gun area. Sickle there with the first nade on the Raptor. Good stuff. They're looking fresh on the rain. Dead round hasn't slowed them down. They are looking to uh, push up and keep up with their good work here. I think uh, Mooney's going to throw the flash out. Strax, I did see him come through burning, and he does pick up Trevs there. So 4v2 in favour of Mooney. Well, Mooney gets one frag there. So 4v2 in favour of Endless here. They're looking at taking away another round. Ray wants to start moving up and start this flank, which I personally know he does very, very well. Mooney is in a bit of bother here. He does see someone in burning. Puts up a couple of shots. Can't get anything. I think he spotted up Ray now coming up for this flank and Ray's gone down with a headshot from Mitch. Nice shooting there. Let's have a look who else we got here. We have got Mitch and Mooney against three. So if um, Endless can just relax here and take it easy they should be able to get this. Exalt heavily tagged because of Mooney's assault rifle. Oh, pokes out the wrong time mate. Sit back wait till you get a bit of health left. Mitch takes him out. That evens it up 2v2. Bomb is probably going down now. I can't hear it go down, but it must be close. Mooney takes down Sickle. So now, what a turnaround. It's all up to Strax here. He's got to be careful. As soon as he pokes out here, I dare say he's going to go down. Nice nade there. But, oh, look oh, at that. Wow. What a finish. And he'll get that easy to fuse. That is wow, outstanding. Wow, wow, wow. That was pretty big. The nades are... Considering uh, Strax was like zero, zero four earlier on. That's right, he's, he's picked yeah. up his game, but these nades are proven to be a massive advantage for Endless. I don't know if they've been stratting their nades, but wow. They did so well. Mitch and me, like Mitch especially played that so smartly then. He did such a good job of, of bringing it back to you know, a situation where they, they, they should have won and then to just lose like that would be so disappointing for boys, especially with a, with a nade and then just getting picked off, trying to get out of the way. That'd be really, really frustrating. So, uh, this round so far so good. Rain hasn't died to fresh yet, so uh, that's got to be a positive. Mitch has actually pushed all the way down to the bottom of, of A stairs here. Can you see someone? He's getting shot at. No, it must be someone in bottom of burning. It looks like he was um, shooting at him. So, Raptor this time with scope. And he's these guys are just making silly mistakes all over the place. Raptor actually throwing smoke into the awning and back into the shop so that's not ideal trevs and muni still going to try and get onto that b-bomb we have a look ray hasn't been able to flank yet because i think mitch has been so far down that uh far left side covering a that he hasn't had much of an opportunity bomb must be close to planet muni has got the bomb and he <laughs> he did have that stupid glitch having to run away with the bomb pressing all the buttons trevs will take out fresh <laughs> exalt is going to go down to raptor so uh finally Finally, the guys are going to get the, the better deal of that scope battle. Ray takes out Rain, though. Rain not having a, a very good day. I'm sure he's probably raging in TS right about now. Trebs picks up Ray, so no more flanking from him today. Almost going to Muni, though, with a, with a bit of uh, friendly fire. But that round will go to Elevate, and it didn't end up playing quite well. So the difference that round, I felt, was that they managed to cover that A flank quite well. And... Uh, and they didn't lose mid early on. That's really, you know, if you've got the numbers and you can get the bomb down, you should be fine. That's all it is. Just just don't get flanked. Don't get shot by a fresh in mid randomly. I have no idea what's going on there. But uh, it's, it's been really weird. 
Yeah, it is. I think Mitch played a big part in that last round because he just caused um, more than enough disruption for Ray to not come up in flank and really stuffed with his head a little bit, which worked out for him. Mitch does get first blood or second blood. Didn't see who picked yeah. up first blood there. Rain, is... Rain died to fresh in mid again oh, no. from the same <laughs> flank. Yep. So, I, I don't understand. That's right. He needs to adjust to that, and I'm sure he will this time. Exalt, a nice headshot on the Raptor. Scope for his scope. Exalt, still in front. Still in front in this uh, mighty battle here. Keeping an eye out. He does spot someone. That was a nice shot there. Exalt on the Mooney behind that van. Now he's just going to shoot some out. Hopefully pick up a frag or a kill or a tag or a kill. Sickle does get one. Look at that. They were absolutely massive that round. And this doesn't look like the Elevate we're used to watching, Sam, man. Look, if, if I had spare 50 bucks and someone's willing to take it, I'd say this isn't even elevated at all. I'm pretty sure it's like no chance with different tags on for a bit of a lull. I I'm genuinely don't know what's going on here. Seahawk it's, V2. It's really confusing. Yeah, well, yeah, it's just... Hopefully they'll change things. Like, I still think they'll go fight and defense. And they're 5 and 6 on attack, so... It's not like it's the uh, end of the world, you know, so they're getting destroyed here. Oh, yeah. Or they're trying to, to defend... <laughs> Raptor onto Exalt, Fresh picks up Rain again. Mitch takes out SIQL, so that's four and three. Elevate got the oh, advantage, and uh, Fresh finally going to go down Mitch. Fresh uh, Fresh is going to be like, uh, I don't know, Rain's going to turn off at his house tomorrow, and that's just going to be the end of the story, I think. Definitely not ideal. Bomb plant does go down. Endless only have two plays up here. Muni. Going to jump back onto Sandbag. Mitch packs up Strax. Trev's going to go down to Ray. So it's just Ray left. And let's have a look where he is. He's a long way. Oh, yeah, he's a long way away from, from uh, being successful in this round. And he's going to go and die to, I assume, uh, Raptor with scope. Unless they've given it to Mitch again. Nope. Raptor, who's uh, three and two at the moment. Uh, he's probably, uh, I think he must have disconnected at some point. But uh, that's going to bring us back six and six, Sinai. So as much as... Uh, as much as Elevate, you know, haven't been four dominating. Six. It's four and six. Ah, oh, two dead rounds. rounds. Full. Yes. They're full. Ouch. Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. What fresh is doing really well here? What he did that time, he actually jumped on the dumpster. So he's really stuffing around with uh, Rain's train of thought here. This time he's sitting back a long way and Elevate pick up the first few frags. So maybe they are finding a bit of a... Uh, momentum here and a little bit more of a flow fresh is coming in for this uh flank once again this time rain's not fooling for that he's prepared and he who's going to win this one? Oh, poor rain goes down to fresh once again and mitch like last time does pick up fresh in retaliation strikes here moving through burning when he takes down sickle and the pro mod is 1v version 1.14 s Let's keep popping up and uh, mucking around with me too. So it's all up to poor Strax here, who's not in a good position, but he is coming up through this main B road. Does spot up one. Nice headshot there on the Mooney. The others will know where he is, and it has been calmed out. So what can he do here with the pressure, knowing there's two more on his uh, trail? Or tail, should I say. Comes around. Not quite good enough. A bit slow to react there. And Elevate now have put three together in a row, Sam, man, which is 5v6 in favour of Endless still. Uh, well, at least they're, at least they're bringing it back. They may be able to come out with the, with that positive. Um, yeah, Rain would be been happy really though. weird. It's been a really weird game, really weird game. I'm going to say they're going to go a fair bit better on defence. To be fair, it's unlikely they're going to go any worse, eh? So uh, we'll see what the guys are going to do here. Fresh uh, again pushing into Garden. I'm I'm going to watch him and see uh, how the, his little battle versus Rain is going to go. We'll see where Rain is. Rain's holding back this time in a completely different spot, just waiting for Fresh to poke that corner. So hopefully he's going to get the better of him this time. A bit of smoke going to go down onto B-Bomb. Muni should be able to get across and uh, plant that bomb, which it certainly looks like it's going to do. Rain does <laughs> take out Fresh, so uh, big congratulations to him. Muni gets out of the road just as a nade drops down. That bomb plant going to be successful. Four and four now. Strat's going to take out Rain in mid. Muni's Looking up into mid by the looks of things. Mitch going to take out Ray and Strax. Exalt picks up Raptor in that scope battle. So that's three and two. We have Trebs over here on the far side of B-Bomb. And I don't think he's going to be silly enough to poke. Mitch uh, is actually pushed all the way 
into that bottom street area and he almost takes someone out. Muni takes out Exol and uh, they're going to clean that one up. So yeah. we must be close to six and six now, I'd assume. So I know their scores are starting to even up. Yeah, six v six, and not just that. Elevate is starting to look a little bit more like Elevate, which is uh, like good Elevate news for them. exactly. And Mooney is really picking up. Look at that, twelve six. Definitely carrying his uh, carrying his weight in this side at the moment. Let's see what's going to happen. Yeah, Rain finally got a kill on the fresh, which was good. Though mind you, fresh nearly still went down. So let's see how Fresh adapts to this. It's a good little battle. He's in the car park here. Not recommended, especially if they throw out... Whoa, excuse me. Especially if they throw out a nade. Mooney here uh, doing what he does. Throws that smoke out, trying to get in to this B bomb side to get that bomb down. And that's where most of their team is. Mooney does pick up Sickle. And bomb is going down now. Trev's watching Mooney's front. Rain takes down Fresh and Strax takes down Rain. Yeah, Rain just not having a good game, but Bomb is down and it's 4v2, so this one here you would think as well is easily going to go to Elevate. Mitch coming up for a flank up through Burning, does see someone up in this white van. Strax nays Trevs, but Mitch takes out Strax, so it's last one up, which is poor Ray here, once again behind this magazine stand. He's in a tough spot, he's not going to get out. Well, I don't know what happened there, a bit of lag maybe from Ray, he was, here. He was next to the magazine rack, then he was about 3 metres in front of it. But that's seven now, so Elevator now in front once again. That's good to see, and I think is you are right having already? his best game. Yeah, it is seven and... Wow. Seven, four, seven, yeah. Live for two rounds, they're restarting just uh, to get those extra two uh, rounds. It's not... On, on defense go. for the boys because of the, the two dead rounds of the auto-switcher. Playing in some position he's not necessarily accustomed to, uh, to accommodate uh, Fresh, and then when he does pick up Fresh, it puts him in such a poor position uh, that that it's you know, it's a bit of a struggle. So, going to grab this here with a bit of uh, a push here. Mitch and uh, Mitch and Muni going to push down to a bomb. He does have the bomb. Muni with the handbag. Three under three is uh, Strax and Ray both go down on this far a side. So the boys should be able to get some smoke down as Ray picks up fresh. So Sickles nice work, in. Ray. He's going to be happy about that one. And uh, lots of fire going to go go. The, the, lots of fire going down here at uh, a Ray jumps in with that UMP takes out SIQL and uh, bomb plant does go down. So XL last player left. Mitch I think must have been down to like two life or something. Ray going to go down to that scope. Not sure if Mitch actually wants to poke scope with ACR, but he's a little bit safe now, probably probably a good idea just to uh, hide back, which he's doing, and uh, I think Muni must have picked up picked him up from another angle there, so nice work from the boys, just trying to bait him out, and Muni picking up the final kill, so they're going to swap over, that was the first A attack of the game, I think, Cyanide. Yeah, I told it, you they'll go to once, may, maybe twice in the 15 rounds over to A, uh, they don't do it too often, I think the most I've seen is probably twice, so... Yeah, they did that then, and what they've done now is they've... Uh, Endless here have really changed up their strats. Fresh has moved right into this van just outside of shop, and they've invested a few more players over to A, so that one round going to A has really changed up Endless's uh, tactics quite a lot. But Elevate are back to their normal... Um, their default strat, if you like, rain into that garden bed. Mooney with the bomb. Raptor takes down Fresh, hiding behind that van. Not a good spot to go, mate. You need to commit and go in that shop or stay back. Smoke is down onto this V-bomb site now. Trev's making way there for Mooney to plant that bomb. So bomb's going down. Trev's here giving him some cover. 4v4. Raptor takes down Exalt. Mooney, I thought Mooney got taken down there, but no, he hasn't. A nade came in, didn't take him down. Ray takes down Ray. Ray takes down Rain and Sickle on the Mooney. Strax on the Trevs. This is it. They've got three up. Strax again. Strax absolutely huge that round, Sam. Man. I don't know what he ended up getting, but there's a few kills. Look at him go. 3 1. And I think he may have got all those three kills just then. Well, that's so, uh, solid work from him. What are, what are our scores now, Cyanide? Well, it's 8 7 in favour of Elevate, and I think this is the real um, half time, isn't it? It is the real time right now, so, so Endless are going to head over onto attack and elevate on, in their more comfortable, I feel, defensive position. So, be interesting to see what they can do from here. 
Everyone's saying eight seven as opposed to nine eight. Question. Yeah, I'll question, go eight question. seven. <laughs> <laughs> Glad someone's keeping sore. That's why mangoes. Well, how normally many, I many doubt myself. Mangoes count. I would doubt myself that everyone else agreed with me in that time. So they're all right. Ray with the bomb. Ah oh, well. Got to give him a go, don't you really, Sam Anx? He's right down at the bottom there. He hasn't managed to do much for his team overall. Um, so, a smoke goes out there, not in the best spot. And this is what I like about Elevate. This is what they do. They actually reverse that smoke and really push up and come in your face so you've got no protection. You smoke up, we'll smoke up. No one can see each other. Well, they're saying smoking up and they're coming in your face. No That's wonder exactly people don't right. like them. <laughs> Trevor's got himself a bit of a bother here. He manages to get—I don't know if he's lagging, but he didn't seem to have smooth, move, smooth movement through that door. Just like my speech at the moment, throws the nade out towards Sandbags. Four v three in favour of Elevate on defence. Let's try and pick up. Mitch is watching A. We got Exalt with the scope, looking down towards Caf A. Can't see nothing. We've actually got two in shop. Exalt's got a friend, which is Sickle, I think, running past my screen. So out they go. He's going to throw that nade down, try and offer a bit of cover. Raptor takes down Exalt. Poke too much. Well played. Sickle watching the back of shop. Raptor keeping an eye on that B-bomb, making sure they don't get through. And Bomb is down, so he's just going to wait for a head to poke. Though you really got to stay smart and stay in there. That's the problem with this map. As soon as you plant that B-bomb... You're absolutely screwed. There's nowhere to move unless you've got good cover from your teammates. Elevate here just moving in for this last kill. And they pick it up and they'll get an easy defuse, which will mean 9 to 7. And I need to change this scoreboard over. There we go. So. There we go. 9 and 7, 16 rounds down. Yeah, I, hopefully, hopefully for Elevate, they'll. They'll be able to show their worth on defense here. But uh, unless they've been playing very well, you really... I can't fault them. I can't really... You can't really ask them to have played better than they have played against Elevate today. To be honest. Raptor going to dig up fresh. Almost picks oh, up geez. Strax as well. With a nice nade coming in. Raptor also picking up Exalt. So uh, scope onto scope here. Raptor's starting to win now that he's on defense. Which uh, apparently appears to be a little bit easy for that scope battle. Oh, there, but oh no, I'm, friendly I'm fire. I'm scoping. <laughs> Mitch on to rain, just trying to even things up, uh, trying to make uh, a little bit more competitive, a, a bit of a better cast, perhaps. I don't think know, he's seen... Maybe, maybe they've had a, maybe they've had a fit. In, I don't uh, think he's seen TS. any friendly names, Sam, man. <laughs> I, uh, I had a look, and I seen him walk in front, and I thought for a second, is that friendly or foe? So you got to take the shot, don't you? Never mind. So right back here with Scope, and he's, uh, he's trying to cover... Both the B-bomb and uh, having a look into uh, Garden at the same time. Strax is actually in Garden. So Strax, uh, if he's not careful, might might walk across that scope. Ray's pushing down down the bottom of A says by the looks of things. And he's got the, the bomb, the handbag at the moment. So if he dies, it's going to be a long way away from the rest of his team to grab that bomb. That's not necessarily ideal, but... Uh, Drak's going to go down. I mean, so Raptor does pick him up because he wasn't particularly oh, careful. If he SIQL. gets one more. Yeah, is that team down? He's picked it up is. two with a nade, two with scope. Or one with a nade, one scope at the beginning, two scope since. And it's just Ray, I believe, who's pushed all the way into A-bomb. And there's, he's going to go down. He's going to plant this bomb. Smoke's going to go down, so they're going to know that he's there. Hopefully, he's going to swap things up. Muni might be the one to get the pick, actually. He's got that uh, Raptor and Muni. Oh, Raptor's going, going in so there, Raptor's Sam. Going he wants the it. team down. They're going to give him the chance here. Oh, he's up the top. Ray should be able to get this. Come on, Ray. That's one miss. Ray, 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 Ray. Raptor's we'll right trouble. there. Raptor. He, he sees, sees him. him. Oh, oh, he's dead. <laughs> Ray's going so strong here. Bomb plant down. 30 seconds on the clock. He's, he's down on a bit of life, but... uh. You'd be all here now. It's going to come from behind, and Mitch are on the other side. Finally, Ray goes down. They're going to get this defused, but uh, that was classic. Ray uh, sticking it to elevate that time. And Raptor nearly getting a team down. A bit unlucky, I guess, wasn't he? Mm. I would need to actually aim the sight with that Magnum, perhaps. I know the boys love to love to hip fire the Magnum. I know the Deagle goes better hip fire, but surely it doesn't hurt to uh, aim down sight. So that With brings us to shots. 7 and 10 here, Sandman. 
And off they go again. They need to do something because they're just starting to slip behind a few rounds now. And with the way they've played, you'd really want them to get 10 plus rounds, I think. With Ray taking down Mitch and Rain gets a headshot on Fresh. So maybe those two have reversed themselves a little bit. Four on four, Strax here. Nice shot on Ray coming down into that garden. 3v3 now with Raptor taking out Sickle. Raptor really proving himself on defense here with that scope. Absolutely huge. Ray's got him done the old switcheroonie again. Coming to A with that bomb while Trevs takes down Strax. Does spot someone... Yeah, the bottom of burning, and Ray takes down Trez with a nice headshot. 2v2. Mooney is just on this main road on B. x -Alt is watching from the shop, and Raptor is... Can't quite see where Raptor is. There we go. He's looking onto that uh, A walkway, and Ray's right at the bottom of it, so he's looking in the wrong spot. And that little bit of a noise there may not be good for Ray, because Mooney's just up around the corner here. But Ray's in a good spot to get through here. He's certainly taking his time. He's trying to be a sneaky little bugger, isn't he? Let's see if Exalt... So Mooney's coming around. There we go. Ray takes down Raptor with a headshot. They've got two. So Exalt here needs to probably move up a little bit and give his teammates some cover. Where's Mooney gone? Running out of time. Mooney's just got his eyes right on that bomb site. Now flicking back into mid. So Exalt... So Exalt's in a good spot here. Just stop moving. Stay there. There he goes. He sees Mooney and they actually pick one back. Well played. Very well played. That's exactly what they needed. 8 to 10 in favour of Endless. In favour of Elevate, should I say. Nice, uh, nice round of win on attack to Endless here. I'll take this round. This will be my last round and I'm going to bail. Serious business times here. But uh, good to be involved in this one. Ray's grabbed our bomb and he's going to jump down these A stairs again. So it's funny that A that uh, Ray even plays those A stairs both on attack and defense and he likes to grab the bomb. Raptor's going to go down to a nade from Fresh. Ray will pick up Mitch on A stairs. Uh, he takes that one pick, decides to change things up. Ray takes out SI, QL and the boys look like they're going to try and push down here to B bomb. No, Ray is back and forward, back and forward, hoping to, uh, hoping to grab a pick, perhaps jumping down to the bottom of A stairs, just seeing not committing, I suppose, to any particular side until he's uh, comfortable with there. That certainly worked for him last round. Fresh takes out Trebs. So just two plays left here for Elevate. Muni is, uh, looks like he's pushed his way into shop. And Rain is in shop too, which is uh, absolutely nowhere near where the bomb is. So Brax and Ray might be able to push all the way down to A-bomb, get this plant down and secure it, which you're going to leave Elevate in a very, very poor position. Fresh uh, has made his way through as well, so... Whilst uh, both remaining players from Elevate are flanking, Endless have uh, pushed all the way down to A-bomb, and uh, Ray's going to get this plant down right now. So, Muni's still in the shop. Rain's still holding top of shop as well. It looks like they've timed out, but I'm sure they're not. They're just uh, just chilling there. Not sure what the deal is. Uh, really a bit weird. Are they throwing the game? Just peculiar. Just peculiar. So, it's going to come down to the two boys, Rain and Muni, to, to play this out together. Muni takes out Exalt. Three plays left. Muni's going to pick up this ACR as well. They've got a bit of work to do. 25 seconds on the clock. Three plays to kill and a bomb to defuse. Muni gets down to 34 life. Tagged up. We'll take oh. out Strax. Fresh will take out Rain. So two under one. 60 life. He should get back to full life oh, now. But awesome. that's going to be the end of it. Endless going huge that round. Very solid round. Probably not very well played by LA. Just perhaps a little bit too aggressive in a... I'm going to say uh, GG to that one and have a fantastic cast. No worries, Sam, man. Thank you very much for dropping in. We'll catch you later. So, well played that last round for Endless. No doubt about that. 9 to 10, so really closing in that gap as well. It's hard to pick a winner at this point. I don't think we're going to see overtime. One of these teams are going to start excelling and just push out and take it by the bulls and win the match. Ray... Loves these ace theirs. Absolutely he does. Going to throw out an ace. See if he can't pick up a tag or anything. No tags. No tags. Fans going to go down. Trev's in burning here. Rain up in the car park. So just trying to add a little bit of presence. Mitch here keeping an eye on or uh, keeping the reins on Ray here. Making sure he's not getting away too much. Trev's does take down Exalt. 5v3 in favour of in favor of elevate so they're probably looking at winning this winning this round 
bomb is down though, so they just need to defend this. We do have Ray stuck on the bomb site. He gets taken down by Raid. Trev's nice shot there, headshot on Distrax, and the defuse will go down with ease as there's only one player up. Unless, no, there we go. So the defuse will go in favour of Elevate, which pulls it out to 11 to 9, uh, Martin. Yeah, you know, I'll play that very well. They um, pushed forward like they usually do with smoke and cleared out the planter and the defenders and got a very easy defuse very quickly. Well, I think they knew that anyway, too. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. going to pull up Raptor here as Scope, who um, has been going very well on defense. He's gone 6-3 to three now with um, TBA or Endless now. They're going to... Push B again, rather slowly this time. We've got Sickle in shop. Trev's taken down Fresh in mid, I believe. And Strat is now scope for Endless, no longer Exalt. So it's um, very slow. You've got Ray taking down Rain with Trev's on Exalt. So it's four up against three here, and it's not a lot happening. Just hanging around in the garden, having a look into burning. Just fapping about, really. Although Raptor's got eyes on their he does scope have eyes now on someone. the man. I believe it was scope in a ghillie suit, I believe. But Yeah, we've got... Uh, it's very slow. Not sure if they're going to try and push out with a smoke, or if they're really planning on doing anything. Well, Strax here are missing Strax and Raptor here. They're both going to try and have a bit of a scope battle. I don't know where Raptor's gone. Raptor is... He's moved. He's gone down below under cafe. Here he comes. He's back up now. Oh, Strax, nice shot. Very nice shot. It's pretty unfortunate for Raptor. I thought he would have picked that one up. But anyway, Mitch on the sequel, and now you've got some action. You've got the plant going down on B, and you've actually got two elevate players, Trevs, and I don't know who else that is, but they're flanking. And you've got Mooney onto Ray. With just one up here, Strax getting taken down by Mitch, and elevate will again get an easy defuse. Yeah, I thought Endless um, were a bit too slow that round. I like to go fast and get the plant down as soon as possible and give yourself the best chance to defend it, but hey, I'm clearly not the best at this game. Yeah, Rage really picked up since half time here, looking good with 8 and 4 and doing the good work with that bomb. Uh, who haven't we given much love to? Let's have a look a bit fresh. We haven't seen fresh for a while. Throws his nade and flash out into this car park he does get a tag but that's about it strax takes down raptor and mitch onto ray so bomb is down on these a stairs here and fresh is moving into this middle area just up into the car park can't see anyone in burning which is good mooney here sees a smoke go down this is what they do as soon as they see a smoke down they reverse that smoke and then really push up to try and be aggressive and give themselves a good advantage here treads keeping an eye on this Burning building does see fresh now sees his headshot takes him down with ease and nearly a plus 10 there Rain finishes off exalt Mitch on the strikes and it's only one up here, which is sick on he's in all sorts of bother here heavily tagged does pick up one I think but couldn't quite get anything else though 4v1 is a tough situation to be in and elevate Pull it away again. So 913 in favor of elevate elevate in another three rounds or endless need another Six rounds to push it in overtime, and I can't see that happening. I think Elevate should be the clear winners of this round. Or this match, should I yeah, say. Def yeah, I think um, Elevate are just pulling away now. Just getting themselves to a bit of a lead. You know, you've got Endless now going down to A. Although, Mitch got absolutely massive there. Getting a double nade onto the car, taking out Fresh and Exalt. Ray onto Mitch. So... Rain, he's in garden. I believe he's going to try a bit of a flank, and you've got Trez sitting here in traffic at the green car, still expecting a bit of an A push. Although well, Elevate are fully paired, I believe they're all focused now. you got a lot of gunfire, Trez onto Ray, Rain onto Strax, and it's just Sickle up again for Endless. With four of Elevate, this is going to be a tough one. And he gets taken down by Rain, I think, or Mooney, one of them. Not a hundred percent sure what Endless tried to do there, all running down a stairs. I guess they thought they would try something, but my goodness, it just didn't work out well for them. You gotta stay disciplined. 
no matter what stage of the game it's at, and that's how things are work out in your favour. So Ray, once again, really liking these A stairs. And Nate already goes out, probably from Mitch. And Ray's going to hold that. Hopefully he doesn't drop the bomb. Fresh here, heavily tagged in mid, mid-garden. Can't see his... Can't see his attacker, though. So he's going to move up slowly, see what's going on. Mooney, a couple of shots out in his direction. Hopefully to pick up a tag. Doesn't get anything. And keeping an eye on this B bomb site. Trev's still in... Burning, keeping it solid. Rain and Fresh. This battle tonight between these two players has been really, really good. Rain uh, winning all the defensive ones, just like Fresh did. So, 4v4. They've only one dropped both sides. Mitch here. Want to push this A stairs. Hopefully get a flank. I think Ray and Mitch have counted each other very well tonight. As have uh, the Scopes and, well, Exalt and Raptor. Also, Ray. Uh, not Ray. Um... Fresh and Rain have been going up. So we've got Rain and Mitch here coming in for this wide flank. It's only three left. Bombs down, but they know there's one in the shop. There must be still one at the bomb site. One just in front of the van here. Mitch takes Ray out with a headshot, so Bomb was down. But they're running out of time. And players here. Mitch gets taken down behind from Sickle. Well played, Sickle. No, he's in the shop. He tricked me a little bit. Mooney takes down Sickle with a nice headshot. Raptor with a scope, giving him some cover. Strax does take down Rain. Mooney takes down Strax, so they will get this one, which will be 15 to 9. So Elevate, probably pull up the next round and win this match, but it has been a good match. I don't think the score really Baz. reflects the uh, closeness and the great little battles which have gone around all over between two teams. Yeah, it's been pretty close all game. With um, Endless, they got left behind a little bit, but then they came back, back to bring it to 10 to 9, but... Once again, it looks like Elevate are just pulling away and probably going to bring the win up here. So I wouldn't mind seeing Endless um, doing a fast B. I reckon they'd catch Elevate off guard just a little bit and they might actually pick back around, get themselves a little bit more uh, dignity. But once again, they decided to go slow and really just fap around, doing nothing for a good 30 seconds and then rush the bomb site like idiots but that's just my opinion Mooney taking down fresh and after scoping like usual into shop there and oh, they make it difficult to pass these ones there's not a lot happening it's just literally looking at nothing going nowhere they should know that elevates mine enough not to poke but you know they don't. Well, Ray's all the way down at A here. All the way down at A, and you got three more at B. You do see... So we got one at Cafe, one in Grey Car. Ray's just gone down there and dropped the bomb. So you got three up near shop. Mitch takes took down Ray. So uh, bomb all the way down at bottom of A stairs. Three in shop. It's going to make it hard with 3v5 here. Uh, Martin Treves does get a frag onto Strax, pushing up. That's a nice shot there by Sickle with a headshot on Rain. 4v2, but they're running out of time. 30 seconds left, and they need to get that bomb down. They're nowhere near it. That's the problem when you run that bomb nowhere near the rest of your team. Exalt does pick up a frag, but Elevate come out the winners. And a very, very good match there. I did enjoy that one. Like I said, lots and lots of little mini battles all over the uh, all over the map. And well played to Elevate. So Elevate 2 out of 2 tonight. Well played. Definitely. I mean, that one's 16 to 9 and beating Wifer 16 to 7. Both winning rather convincingly. So, well played. Thanks for jumping on in with us tonight, Martin. Thanks to Sam, man, for uh, jumping in as well. Thanks, for everyone, for watching. If you haven't followed us, please follow us. Um, but that's probably it for us tonight. It's, uh, it's enough casting for one night. So, we'll catch you guys, as I said, late tomorrow night. Um, I'm not sure of the time. We are doing a quick Black Ops match, um, and I think we might have a special guest on before the um, before the car. Something a little bit different for you guys. Don't know how it's going to turn out, but if anything, it will be it will be interesting. So, thanks a lot, Martin, and that's it for us. We'll catch you guys later. See ya.